Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Paul Sherry RVs. My name is Bill. Today I'm going to feature a 26 foot Chateau. It's a 2015. It's on a Ford chassis. It's got the V10 in it. It's going to be plenty strong enough to pull. I think this unit will pull about 6,000 pounds without any problem. A couple nice things about this unit, it's got Michelin tires all the way around. It's got the paint and fiberglass mixed. You could take a screwdriver or a nail or whatever and scrape right in there. The color is going to go right through. It's got a Cummins. It's a 4,000 generator. It's going to make plenty of power. You can run everything in the unit at once. It's a gas electric water heater. The propane is 40.9 pounds. It's a large tank. Here at the back of the coach, it's got a 5,000 pound hitch. And like I was saying when we were up front, it will pull 6,000 pounds easily, possibly even more. They use a special gel coat on the front and rear cap that's gonna help it from fading. The roof is a walkable roof. I wouldn't recommend any dance parties up there, but if you need to get up there for maintenance or a couple people on top, you're good to go. Backup camera uh, works off of a Panasonic AM FM stereo CD DVD in the front, in the dashboard. Probably what sets Chateau apart, other than being a debt-free company that's got uh, the largest dealer network in the country, is that every unit goes to more ride. What they do is they build up the frame, they put full I-beam rails on top of Ford's chassis, they put a neoprene filter substance in between there, it's good for quietness and it's gonna be a smoother ride. Also, they balance the drive shaft. When you balance a drive shaft, it's gonna take out a lot of vibrations out of the coach. Moving along here to the side, you can see that it uses a Schwinn Tech system. It's a double, it's a double motor on the slide. This unit has one slide just in the bedroom, but it still has a lot of storage. Their Rotocast storage, it's going to give you no, no rust, no leaks unless you break them. The furnace is a 30,000 BTU, and if you've ever camped in a camper and had to turn the furnace on, you know that this 30,000 BTUs will really blow you out of the place. Another nice feature in the, in the uh, slide room is that the uh, windows are usable windows. You can open them up, you can get a full cross ventilation. This slide out also has an awning topper. All right, coming into the steps, uh, when you get mature like myself, you like these big grab handles, it's always comforting to know that they're steel reinforced, so you can really get a good hold on them. Another thing nice on top of the floor and more ride that Chateau does, this is a one piece uh, floor. It happens to be slip and stain resistant, cold crack resistant, it's a, it's a Trek product but it's one piece, even in Chateau, if you go up to their 31 footers, there's never a seam in it. In a 26 footer, you gotta find a lot of space for storage. You're in a, you're in a smaller motor home, so every, every little nook and cranny is used. Here's your control panel. It's where you start your generator, run your slide room. This particular unit has gray and black tank heaters. The water pumps here and the two switches for the water heater because you can run it on either gas or electric. Also, you can check your LP, your battery, and all the levels in your tanks. The drawers are roller bearing and they really come out all the way, every drawer, nice and smooth, and you're not reaching to the back. Even though it's a 26 footer, it's ducted air. You can run it only through the ducts front to back or you can, if you're gonna be in the living room, dining room area, you can dump the cold air right, right down on you. Countertops are beautiful, three burner stove. Plenty of, plenty of storage. This particular storage cabinet right here has a hanger or you can adjust the shelves up and down. 
In the bathroom, notice a full piano spring on the hinge. It's gonna be durable, quiet. And in the bath itself, we've got a porcelain tool. It sits up nice and high. The step-in shower is only about 10 inches to step in. Tall people can use it comfortably because of the skylight and the vent. On this 26, because the bed's in a slide, you can still get around this bed and get in either side. That's a real, real nice feature in a small Class C motorhome because in the corner beds, without the slides, it's really hard to make and hard to get in and out. You know, and us mature people, again, we like a light and a plug on each side, and this has it, as well as when we talked about the ventilation on both sides. Refrigerators are nor cold, and my personal survey of RV people here in the Midwest, the Norcold is definitely the most popular. Longevity, lack of problems. It's a two door, you got plenty of room. Again, storage all the way around the top. When every piece that comes in here is leveled. So you, know, you start with a base from Ford, you put the more ride system on it, you build up the no seams in the floor, every piece of, uh, of uh, furniture and equipment that comes in here is leveled as it's put in. Down the road quiet, down the road smooth. Up here in the cab again it's a Ford chassis, but it's not just a real cheap Ford chassis. It's got tilt wheel, it's got cruise control, it's got power windows, power door locks, it's got the uh, Pioneer backup camera you can see it's on right now. And it's also an AM FM stereo CD player. Up here in the, in the loft, it's got a TV. Now the TV is on a swing arm, so you can, you can pull that out and angle it for about anywhere in the whole coach. It's got cup holders up here. There's electric outlets. When you pull this over and put it in, it makes a real nice bed. It curtains on both sides. You can give yourself a little privacy up there. There's a vent, a couple air conditioning vents. All the lights are LED right down the middle. You can sleep eight people, two on the couch, two on a dinette, two on the, in the loft, and two in the master bedroom. This is a real neat feature. This is called the Dream Dinette. You can operate it with a hand, put it back up into position, you can lock it into, into place so it stays up. Cup holders. Also, uh, there's going to be seat belts at the couch and the dinette. A nice storage drawer here. Again, the bearing slide. So give us a call here at Paul Sherry RVs. You got a lot of people here that are expert. Mr. Sherry started the business in the 60s and it's just been a wonderful place to work and I think we have a great reputation. Give us a chance, we'll prove it.